Hello everyone, this is Satvik and in this video we will discuss about a cool tool which helps you in achieving privacy uh, while using Kali Linux. So without getting any delay, let's dive into the video. So first of all, really thank you guys for all your support. So my channel had surpassed 3000 subscribers and I would really like to thank each and every one of you for helping me and being part of my channel now coming to the part so if you are having any doubts guys please don't choose a youtube comment section because youtube uh, removes some comments which it feels offensive so make sure you check out my discord or uh, discord so that's the best place you can get help from and uh, also if you want to connect to me personally do check uh, my twitter and linkedin accounts uh, which are in the description below so guys uh, if in the previous video or in the previous uh, one of the previous video i had discussed about a tool called as anon akali anon so which which helps you in achieving the same like privacy but uh, that tool is is having a complex structure in it right it is going to feature some various other features but we will in this video we'll discuss about a tool uh, which helps you or which acts like a vpn for you okay while using kali linux it is not only for kali linux you can use that on any linux uh, operating system or linux distribution you are having okay and i, I tested it and it works on uh, almost all the linux distributions out there so the tool that i'm going to showcase in this video is called as uh, uh, anon surf so this is uh, something called as kali anon okay so you can it is of different names but the name uh, which is popular is anon surf so if you are familiar with parrot os and if you are using parrot os feel free to skip this video because uh, this tool is uh, this tool is imported or uh, taken or this tool is of an idea from a tool from parrot os which is being included by default which is named as anon surf so but uh, the uh, the developer had ported this to so any uh, linux distribution that can install this okay so you can see that uh, the all the credit goes to the developer and you can see this is how the tool and you can see there are some things like uh, some other stuff like uh, uh, you can see mostly uh, this particular tool uh, helps you in changing your uh, IP address like it acts as a VPN uh, but before that uh, let me uh, show you something so so there is some com common concepts like VPN uh, proxy chains and uh, uh, Tor okay so this anon surf is going to use something called as Tor so the onion root rotor okay the onion router you can call it anything so in vpn you try to connect to a single proxy and in proxy chains you can have some multiple proxies okay like it can be like two proxies three four five it can vary okay but in tor we only have uh, three proxies okay and this tool is mostly uh, on, built on this particular thing okay so we'll start this thing so let me uh, open my kali here so as i'm showing you for my convenience i'm showing this over kali but you can feel free to use this on any operating system okay or uh, like based on linux only but if you want if you are on windows and if you want to check out like vpns anything like that i would recommend proton vpn okay so do check that out so let me open my terminal guys uh, so this is my terminal here so i enlarge it a bit so let me uh, clone this particular thing so let me go to uh, opt directory and uh, let me clone this particular thing so i'll also provide you the url of this in the description below so no need to worry so so guys after cloning uh, you can simply navigate to that folder and uh, you can simply do an ls so you can see it is pretty simple you can have an installer.sh file so you can read that if you want to or it is going to uh, have something like you can see uh, it is only it should only be run as root okay so it is having have it is uh, importing some repositories and it is installing some tor you can see some tor and something like that as it is uh, as it requires tor so that is how the things happen so let's do uh, as uh, we can also see that this installer.sh is having executable rights here so we can uh, simply go ahead you can do bash uh, installer.sh or uh, you can do dot slash installer.sh you can do anything of your choice let me hit enter so now it is going to install some stuff here so it is going to add some repositories uh, some repositories and also it is going to do check for uh, it is going to install all the requirements in order to run this tool okay so it is going to take a bit of time 
uh, but if you have a faster internet connectivity then it is a easy go right so let's wait till this done so you can see you can hit y here let me hit enter here once again so it is installing some stuff here you can see uh, you can understand that if you uh, can follow the tough stuff so, so mostly this particular tool is built on tor okay it is not like a traditional vpn because in vpn we use only one proxy but in tor we use some uh, three proxies here okay and it is not even a proxy chain okay so the ideology of this tool is to provide you a uh, security okay while using your linux distribution like mostly as its name suggests kali linux like while you are searching for stuff or anything like that so if you feel if you want to uh put yourself from logging and stuff then i can you, sh you should definitely do check out this tool okay so guys it took around like two to three minutes and it is done so now uh, what i can do is uh, i can simply do anon surf you can hit tab and it is going to auto complete like you can do this from any directory you shouldn't be in this directory only you can simply do an anon surf like it is like a command line tool as of from now as we installed all the stuff so that particular script the bash script had uh, made some changes okay so this is the thing you don't need to add dot slash or anything else you can simply type anon surf like like assume, assume it like an map okay so we try we type n map and hyphen hyphen help and even announce of is like a built-in tool from now so you can simply do hyphen hyphen help here so that we can see all the options here okay you can see uh, you can see some you can assume something like this is uh something uh like if you are familiar with parrot so this is how in parrot os looks like the terminal and stuff so you can see the easy points or something that are easier status so start so in order to start the proxy a tor proxy and in order to stop it stop in order to restart so if you want to restart or if you want to do anything else you can do that you can use chain like it restarts the tor uh, chain okay so you can do that uh, status and you can do the my ip and you can also start i2p services and you can also stop the i2p services okay so but mostly we'll rely on showing you some basic stuff so start okay and so guys i'll only show you some few options but uh, you can do check them out okay others as well so let me hit start here and you can see it is killing some dangerous applications and also guys uh, make sure you have uh you, you make sure you are running this as root okay here i am root here by default so i'm not adding sudo in front but if you are having any issues make su make sure you had sudo okay so now we had started it and now we can see uh status so if you can status you can see the tor service is running here and you can see stuff here like if you you can hit you can come out of here by simply hitting q here you can do and uh, there is something like options we can look for various options uh like uh, my ip so so as we started the service you can simply type my ip option and you can uh, find out what is your particular ip address that you are connected to okay like we are in this particular thing so let me copy this thing and let me find out what is this here like you can simply go to who is dot domain lookup dot com and you can try to find out where this ip is located okay so this particular tool uh, is helpful like it's a web application tool okay so you can simply paste the ip address here and let me search where it is going to or where it is located okay so let it take some time for loading because as we are connected to the tor you can see that there is definitely some uh, issue there you can see we am right now in romania uh, not uh, physically but virtually okay so that is how it's happening and you can also uh, stop this thing okay by simply doing stop here so it is going to uh, kill the services and you can do my ip so your ip address will be the normal ip address only okay like the normal address you get connected to okay and you can start it once again okay you can start it and you can uh, you can restart it as well like let's let me look my ip address now so my ip address is uh, 207 now let me restart it like it is going to restart uh, the service again and now we look for the ip address so now we can see that the ip address previously and now it got changed okay like you can try to experiment this particular tool 
in various ways like you can uh, try to play with this tool but the main purpose of this tool is like you can use this like a free vpn kind of thing okay uh, this tool has some ideology of if you are familiar with a to an application mobile application called orbot so orbot is a application uh, that helps you in uh, connecting to various apps like you can route the traffic of an uh, application or anything like that to the through the tor network but this announce of a tool is going to help us in uh, what you call in order to uh, make all the traffic that is going through uh, going from our system looks like it is going from uh, other service like it is trying to proxy it okay so this is everything regarding this tool guys so i shown you some few options you can do check out the others as well so this is everything regarding this video i hope you find this video helpful and uh, if you find it helpful do share with your friends so that they can also uh, keep aware of themselves and also guys if you really like this video make sure you like it and do share so that so that the content could reach more people so this is satvik signing off and i'll meet you in the next video thank you